This is a mind practice and we work with the vehicle of the body absolutely and we get all these physical benefits but it's really about uh, that coming to that place of mindfulness because every time you do that you start to carve a different neural pathway in your brain so the more you're present the more it's easier to be present mm. um, and the, the more you're present the less you're in the old programming mm. and it's that programming that is causing us so much suffering. I do her yoga classes in Bondi and I feel like I'm going to church, spiritual church, when I do her classes because it's never just about your body and getting the right pose or anything. She's actually also throughout the whole lesson working on your mind at the same time which is really the essence of yoga and that's what I wanted to share with you all today is that mm. knowledge. Well so said, you. you nailed that, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Um, so tell us, Amy, about how you actually came to yoga in the first place. So I got into drama school mm -hmm. and um, we had to do yoga every day before our movement class. Mm -hmm. And I think for the first five years of yoga, I cried almost at least once a week, but, but probably more realistically, because there was just a lot of stuff that I had buried, a lot of pain. And I mentioned my addiction stuff, so then I would then drink and drug that down. So then. Um, I think that has to be mentioned because yoga then brought me into the place where I wanted to become clean and sober and I have been for nine years now. I loved what it was bringing up for me, I loved what um, it was revealing about myself and yeah it felt like I was really on a journey towards some healing mm. which I didn't even know that I needed. It's a whole shedding of the stuff that we don't need and starting to embrace the beauty that we are. I think it's very much a, a holistic thing, mm -hmm. so um, which is I think why I appreciate yoga so much because it is really yes about body, mm -hmm. but it's um, also has the spiritual element and the mm -hmm. mental element. When we're living in a world where the image is really important, mm -hmm. our relationship with our body is more about what we see in the mirror rather than how it actually feels. Mm -hmm. So it's it's that coming home to to self and and starting to appreciate, again, that, that radiant beauty that we already are. We're, from a yogic perspective, we're born with it. Mm. So we, we already are light, we already are love, and we already are life. Mm. It's just, it's all there. So our, our practice and that process of healing is coming back to what is already there. Mm. And that to me is so much more important than eyeshadow. Mm. Although I love eyeshadow. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's that real, it always comes back to, to realizing our true nature. Mm. Yeah.